No. <laughs> and that's a violation. <laughs> Um, no, I was simply using that as an example to say if you endorse these recommendations, every single one of them has to come back to you in a very concrete form for your action. But I would like enough direction from you saying go forth and follow up on every single one of these recommendations yes. or change them as you see fit. Yes. Or come back with two, uh, a preferred option and a secondary option, okay? All we're asking for is more precision that takes into account better data. Yeah, we need to bring you more back precisely to the stated table. that takes into the full range of options. I think. So do d does fine it need tune to be the instrument is what? Just direction. Yeah. So we're we're just giving very general direction. I mean, one uh, you also have to take into consideration all of the comments that Absolutely. you got today from the public and, and yes. less so actually from the board. But the public, I mean, there were some concerns about the MCCSD uh, using that as the, as, as, as the data. I mean, yeah. that was one of the comments yeah. that was made. So I don't know what yeah. you're going to do with yeah. that, but then you've got to bring it all back to us. Right. Uh, you know, and what we're going to do with that is we've heard that as a concern. Okay. We do feel that by aligning the definitions and doing the verifications that we're talking about, that we can address those concerns, as okay. an example. So any other board comments on this? Are we finished? Finished. So you have the direction you need? Yes. Yes. She does. Great. OK, good. Good. Thank you, everybody, no. for coming. Now let's race over the hill to So wait, wait just wait, a minute. Wait. Supervisor. Annabelle. Supervisor. You could stay huh? here, you know. Huh? You could, yeah. We're going to try and make sure there's some place to watch TV. We, we just, uh, Turn the radio <laughs> around, David. Uh, don't want to leave? Hey, tip, tip. I'm not in a um, You need to come on back, come on, Mr. Come Chair. Come, come on. on. Point of order. I don't, I, I'm not completely clear on. The, the, we talked about the recommendations, we talked about options to the recommendations. Clarify for me what you believe your direction is, Ms. Glassy. What I believe my the direction Reader's Digest is, version. is is the um, taking each of these recommendations and bringing back the implementation action that the board would vote up or down on. And then as Supervisor Colfax mentioned, and there may be an option for each one of those as well. Yeah. The, the one area that it seems like there was considerable difference of opinion it was around the 46 or 53 we'll certainly research that legally a little bit more and if something points us in a different direction we'll present that as an option okay because that's one of the quite obvious issues that i have when i have two letters here from our planning department that spell out the process and use the 55 number and then at a Two month later date use the 53 number to me that spells it out pretty dang clear so if those three those two documents right here pretty much show what the county's position was in 1992 mm -hmm. and that's at 53 so yeah you can we'll, take a look at those i'm sure you yeah, have we them. will look at but them. that's what if that's an, if that's one of the options on that one that makes me a little happier mm -hmm. the only other comment i have is on number two when you talk about that the to update the tables that it's with the legal rooms. Okay. Because there's no sense putting illegal rooms on our tables because they don't exist right. legally. But the legal rooms on those tables, there will be different numbers. But that's, that's the right. clarification on that one. Right. And that combined with, you know, the direction that you'll give in response to whatever process we bring you on 13, um, which is dealing with the illegal units, that taken together fits and then you'll have a complete package. Uh, one concern I have, Ms. Glassy, is that it seemed that part of not getting all of this perhaps in a timely manner uh, relative to when the, uh, the, the agenda was published and having it follow a day later, you know, it seems that we perhaps didn't allow enough time going into it. I mean, I think that you 
set yourselves up, so to speak, probably with the board request to get it back, you know, ASAP. So I think that we need to make sure that we allow, that you allow enough time so that isn't the scenario, so the public gets it in a timely manner, everyone gets the information when the agenda is published, and we'll omit some of the yeah. problems if we, you know, if, you're allow, if you allow adequate yeah. time to do the complexity of things that need to happen. Uh, definitely, I hear you on that. I think there was probably some desire since there's not a board meeting next right. week, and but you will note I didn't put any dates on Good. these recommendations. Okay. All right, have, anything else? Kendall, we have a no, we, we thank you for your time given you. all the other things going on. Okay. Good. Thank you very much. Thank you to all of you. So we have, uh, I guess, an off agenda item. According yeah. to you. I had an off agenda item this morning, but it was covered to the clerk. You, you have one from DOT. That's what I Sorry. recalled. Sorry. Go ahead, yeah. Christy. It's here. We have it here. So we've received a request yeah, to authorize the chair to sign Caltrans form yes. and requesting extension of funding for two seismic retrofit projects. And the action they're requesting is that by minute order, the board approve the proposed request and authorize the board chair to sign the documentation. And the urgency findings are because this needs to be transmitted prior to the next session of the board. What's the number? It doesn't have a number because it's okay. an off agenda item. But you're welcome to look at this one if you need to. So with so Chair moved, Mr. Chairman. Back. Okay, there is a motion before us to take this up as an off agenda Second. item. And there is a second discussion to the motion. Aye. Aye. All those in favor of taking it up as an off agenda item say aye. Aye. Aye.